Hello, this is the Lime Mass. We're going to continue. Um, I think it was episode 3. Was it episode 3? Uh, no, 4. Ep oh, nope. We don't want to go that far back. Ooh, hopefully that didn't freaking... Hopefully that didn't freaking change anything. Okay, yeah. So, this is the Lime Mask. We are going to continue on Season 2 of The Walking Dead, Chapter 4. And... You first. We need you up top. Oh, I guess it went that far back. Uh, I don't know why. That's uh, what actually say. Uh, okay, come on. Clem. Sarah, we have to go. Are you listening? Now, Clementine. If she doesn't want to go, you can't make her. Don't let her take you down, too. Not again. Look, I know what you're trying to do, but it's not going to work. I can't! I can't! I can't! Daddy! Snap out of it, Sarah! Please! You can't save her, Clem. We have to go! Believe me, I know about this. Hurry up! <gasps> Move! Clementine! Grab her! <sighs> We gotta go. Sarah. Come on. Look, I hate to ask this, but are we there yet? <laughs> We're not far. Look, Sarah, you can get through this. We both will. But I'm not okay. Just try. Can you do that? She just needs a little time, Clem. Leave her be for a bit. I don't know about this. The way she is, she's gonna cause problems. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just, I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I, I don't mean to sound harsh. It's just the way things are. Does that mean you'd turn on me if I was hurt or something? No. I mean, Clem, I wouldn't have to. And just because you got her out of there today doesn't mean you saved her. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. I just, I can't believe it. As soon as you guys said go, I was the first one up on the roof. Like I had already made up my mind. Luke, you can't let it eat away at you. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her, or push her, or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time, Walker's cornered us forced us up to the roof, and, and when they kept coming, I, I couldn't make her jump, couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted, and I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself. You left your sister? Did she get turned? Do you know? 
when she didn't follow me over, I didn't have the guts to go back and see for myself. Hmm. I killed well, me for a long time. Alive, then. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell, when all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Sarah isn't dangerous. She's gonna be okay. Fine. Just be careful. Come on. Let's get back to your friends. Son of a bitch. You found him? Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Sarah, how you doing, hon? That's okay, sweetie. Whenever you're ready, I'm just glad you're here. But wait, wait, where's Nick? Uh, Rebecca, how about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. No. No. I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know, does Luke know anything about babies? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Kenny had a family. He could help. Where is he? He brought Sarita in there not long after you left. I don't know if he's done it yet. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. Uh, I'll go in there. Thank you, Clem. I really do think that might be best. <sighs> Damn, that startled me for a little bit. I wanted to check on you. Make sure you're okay. She didn't want me to wait, but I had to. In case by some crazy chance, she didn't come back. That beautiful face. Sarita was a good person. I liked her. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Duck. Gotcha. Sarita. No peace. No rest. The punches just keep coming. Why the hell could Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That baby's almost here, and Rebecca needs your help. Yeah, I guess she does. Now, nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. Maybe one of the others can look at it for you. Oh, shit. Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? 
we should see what's going on. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. Well, what do we do? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. It hurts more than before. Is something wrong? This place doesn't seem safe for a baby being born. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah? You just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem... I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mac a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking, how do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would have never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfecting. That all sound right? Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. I want to check on Sarah. I'll help everyone else, too. I think that'd be good. Yeah, yeah, sure. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. Hey, Sarah. You know, Rebecca's starting... They were going to leave me, weren't they? Jane didn't mean what she said. I think she gets scared, too, about what might happen. How come you didn't leave me? Because we're friends. I could never be that good of a friend. I just want my dad. I know. When he... when he gets here, we should all go back to the cabin. We're safe there. Sarah, your dad, you know he isn't coming, right? Sarah? Hey, I think that's all she can take for now. She'll be all right. The others could really use a hand scout for supplies. I'll go help Jane. Good. Don't be too long if you can help it. Okay, I might do one little different thing. I don't know if this will affect the game. Probably not. Oh, hey. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. Just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. I like the height.
You know, you don't seem okay. Huh? Well, yeah, but who is okay? Let's just focus on this right now. I hope this place is what we're looking for. God knows we could use a break. Check this out. This gate's still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? If it's locked, maybe there's still food. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. A nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Find anything? No, not even trash. You think this thing still works? <laughs> Check the muzzle, Napoleon. Oh. They fill them with cement so they're safe. I guess it's broken. Yeah, I think I almost had it. Keep looking. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind, though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. this way and who knows if he has friends nearby i don't like having some stranger sneaking around so why is he coming up here no idea but we should scope him out and see what he's up to i don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others we've got enough on our plates with a baby coming last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood we should just try and stay out of sight till he's gone good call now. I can't just wait it out. Oh, okay. Shit. Podasti, podasti. I just want to talk to you. Who are you? I am Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially Malinka Devochka. Uh, little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. Huh? Back up. 
Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I swear to we you. We just need to make sure you're not... Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. If that medicine's for your sister, why are you hiding it in the garbage? I, uh, I need to keep it, I need to keep it safe. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No, you are not nice people. You have already left me defenseless, and now you, you take my sister's medicine? You are fury. Hey, we've got people who are suffering, who need this medicine. Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it. Clementine, we need people that stuff. People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special. Clementine, yes, you must believe We don't believe, believe a fucking word about your sick sister. Please don't make my sister suffer. She has been through enough. Oh, yeah? Well, I think you're just some junkie. You know what that word means, oh, huh? No, no, I'm, I'm telling the truth. I swear upon my own life. I don't believe any of this. <sighs> Medicine, Clement. You know what? I was just gonna keep it. But You're not like... taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. But I gotta oh, feel she... like it's gonna change Thank the story you, if I decide to Thank keep you. it. Thank you. <laughs> no, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Just let me go. Jane, don't do it. Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? We should go get everyone else. Yeah. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place opened. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. that observation dick I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny they said they hadn't heard from you in a while I don't guess there'd be much but Jane seems pretty resourceful the deck might be a safe place we can stay tonight where Rebecca could have the baby at least if we can't find something better I guess that's something I should check it out is Jane still up there now yeah she's trying to get the gift shop opened you know I can't figure her out I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm never quite sure if she just done like people, or just plain out done like me. I like her. She's honest, and she knows what she's doing. Yep. That's more than I can say for some. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just... he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. But I just think he's had to take more than he can handle. You're wrong. Kenny's stronger than anyone. He tries to protect us. I don't know, Clem. I know he's your friend and all. But what Kenny did to Carver, it sounded like he beat right through the corpse and into the floor. Is that where we are now? What would you have done if it was you? 
Well, I don't know. Really, I don't. I just think less. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you, you're getting yourself all worked up over nothing. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Alvin would be really proud of you right now. You think so? I hope you're right. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever gonna do this without him? Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's gonna be a girl. Oh yeah? That big dummy never did have a sense for these things. I've got a feeling this one's a boy. You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Ugh. Oh, shit. I got this. We ain't seen Mike or Bonnie in a while, and I'm not saying I don't trust them, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on them. Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Hey, Clem. I thought you went with Jane. She didn't take off, did she? Take off? Why do you think she'd take off? Well, it's just a, a feeling. Yeah, she's trying to get the place we found ready for Rebecca. Well, that's good. Just give me like 10 more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty handed. What? I just want to help. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I'll watch this side, you watch the other. Deal. Jane said these don't work anymore. Nah, they're just for show. Be handy, though. Also really loud. Good point. Souvenirs, huh? Looking for a keychain with your name on it? No. Why would I want a keychain? I don't even have any keys. Ah, oh, good point. You think maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way? Oh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you do. Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. And someone could use it. Kenny said we need blankets. It's not really a blanket, but... But it should do the trick. Good call. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. It seems like you're with us now. 
That's what matters most. Clem found a jacket. That's great, but uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh, we can't put Rebecca in a Confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. Lee would have loved this place. There have sure been some animals through here. Watch where you step. Any luck? No, not so much. Unless you want some broken glass. Empty. I tell you. I sure don't like being near a graveyard with the world the way it is now. The way things are now, you're in a graveyard all the time. Yeah, true enough. Over here. Water, bottled and clean. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. No, I mean, maybe. All right, all right. I'll go. Thanks, Clem. Just open the door from the other side. Mike will carry those things out. Might be a bit heavy for you. <laughs> I'm stuck. Okay, maybe I push from... Well, that happened. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Thanks, Mike. Yeah, no problem. I'm so sorry about that, Clementine. We should have been more careful. At least now we got something to bring back. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. That looks pretty heavy. Uh, that's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy, but at least his shelves were always full. We'll make a plan. Everyone will have enough. I hope so. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys! Come on, stay close. I just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. We can eat raccoon? I'd eat the shit out of that raccoon. <laughs> Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I am starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Where is it? Over here! with the walkers out there. I'm even hungrier than I was before. 
How'd I get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon? Well, at least it was kind of fun. Yeah. Huh. I guess it was. Come on. Let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. We don't have much time to waste. You're telling me your arms ain't tired? Nope. I could do this all day. No! No! Shit! Shit! Oh, God! Breathe no! like I told you. Okay. 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 Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh. 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 Clem! Clementine! Oh. Shit! Walkers! How'd they get that close without anyone seeing them? That was Luke. Kenny, we've got to do something. You just keep that baby safe. Kenny, we can't stay here. Clementine, where's the place you and Jane found? I'll show you. Good. Someone help me up. Oh, God, there's so many. Mike, the water. On it. as human as I've felt in a long time. I almost forgot what... Clementine! G Jesus, Clem, it's just not... Uh... What's going on? Well, uh... I mean... In here. Let's get you comfortable. What the fuck are you two doing up here? Kenny, what's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. Rebecca's having the baby. Now? No! Fuck. I'm sorry. Shit. Right over Shit. here. Uh. They're coming up the stairs. Here. Uh, we should. You want to help? Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. I've been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Shoot them before they get to us. Shit, that's a lot of them. We need everyone out here. I'm going outside. I'll help hold them back. Go. I've got Rebecca. Here they come. Here. We can't let them up here. There are too many of them. Shit! Keep shooting! They are not getting up here! Find something to block this gate! Help us! We could block the gate with this! I'll help, I'm coming! Together, ready? Oh shit! Holy fuck! What the fuck is going on out there? Get back! Get back! Oh shit! I can't hold on! Help me! Clem! Come on! Help! Jane! Save Sarah! Are you crazy? There's no way she's getting out of that. Pull me up! It's suicide! Just pull me up! Please, Clementine! Take my hand! No! 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 Clementine! No! No! There's nothing we could have done. We could never 
gotten her up here. Push! Oh, shit. They're climbing up. What? They're gonna make it up here. Fuck! Does this shit ever end? We need to break the rest of the deck. She's right. She's right. Drop the whole deck. Drop the... Are you fucking crazy? How are we gonna do that? I don't know. Just look around. That'll work. We bust that, the whole thing comes down. Boost me. They're getting closer. Clementine! Move it! Come on! I'm going as fast as I can. Watch it! Son of a bitch! Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Thank you. <coughs> I'm fine, I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. Clem, why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? Do you want to hold them? Could I? Of course. Your family. Here. should rest especially you when's the last time you slept Kenny How about two years ago I'm fine plus somebody's got to watch you while mama gets your beauty sleep you never forget that smell Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. Go? Go where? Just... away, okay? You know, Jamie, Sarah... I'm not gonna stick around and... watch it happen to you two. You know the score. You're a smart kid. But I thought you believed in me. I do. But give it enough time, and everyone's luck runs out. Listen, 
When the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. It'll make you feel like you do. Like it's all one happy family. Oh, and push comes to shove. I owe these people everything. They've kept me safe, looked out for me. I wouldn't be here without them. Well, they can't keep you safe forever. No one is safe forever. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Versatility is not overrated. Thanks. Yeah. I, um... Uh, I gotta go. You'd be asleep by now. You okay? I'm fine. Okay. Good. <laughs> Hell of a night, though. <sighs> the temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore. See if we can find some place to scavenge. What? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit... Childish? God damn it, Kenny, you know what, just lay off. No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two can roll around like fucking teenagers. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. You guys are both acting like jerks. All you guys do is fight. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane, she made an offer, and Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit. So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else. Fine. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit hey, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. A whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa! What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days, at the least. We've got that baby formula. And won't help the rest of us. Now what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Luke's right. She needs to rest. We should wait a few days. Maybe that's for the best. We don't want to push Rebecca too hard. Just give me a day or two, Kenny. I'll be fine. This is a mistake. But we should all try to get some sleep. It's been a long day. Now we're getting close to the end of the episode. Uh. 
You all right? She's exhausted. We all are. I can keep going. We should have left right away, instead of waiting around. We could have found more food and been someplace warm days ago. We did the right thing. She was in no condition to move. She's worse now. We could still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done, like always. Keeping people alive. You're not helping anything by arguing. Well, don't forget you agreed with me about waiting to leave camp until today. Uh, uh, oh. oh, here. It's a place to sit. Rebecca, let me take the baby. Uh, he's okay. I've got him. No, you rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being weird about it. Yeah, you kind of have been. Kenny knows what he's doing. He's been a dad before. That's not the part I was concerned about. Hello? What is this? Minas Lishna! Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. Hello? Please! He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. Huh. All right. Hello. Your name is... Clementine, yes? Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. How is your sister doing? Sister? Not so good. I need, uh, uh things for... bandages. I need bandages. Are you hurt? No. Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Fuck! Это они? Да. Это они. Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что вы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь, чтобы я взял? Откуда я знаю? Чтобы у них не было. What did your friend say? I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on now. What the hell? Why get excited? Clementine, you robbed this guy? Maybe we can work something out. Arvo, что она говорит? Подожди, подожди. What do you mean? What would you want us to give you? Возмиссию. I'm sorry, Clementine. But we are not here to make deals. Buriko is saying that we will take everything. This can be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. Find my ass! Слушай, Arvo, почему они не слушаются? We have a baby! You have a baby with you? У них грудничковый ребенок. Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking Please. shoot it. I'll do you it. Do it. Don't, don't it. even drop try it, motherfucker. I guarantee move. I'm a better said, shot than you are. I'll drop you both before you can play. Everybody be cool. This doesn't have to go down like this. Don't shoot. Look, you don't look like stupid people. Let's just think about it. If we can work something out, if nobody does anything stupid, Don't make me do it. Look at me. 
So do you hear me? I will kill you if I have to do it. No vibe. No! No vibe! Things are getting a little crazy now. Okay. Left Sarah at the trailer park. You and 40% of players saved Sarah at the trailer park. Robbed Arvo. You and 52% of players refused to steal from Arvo. Selflessness. Crawl through ticket booth window. You and 50% of players volunteered to crawl through. <laughs> I wonder what will happen. We we'll probably wouldn't even get the water if I said no. Nurturing. Held a baby. You and 56 of players. Well, almost 57 percent of players held a baby shot Rebecca you and 42 percent of players chose to shoot Rebecca I didn't shoot her Kenny did all right so yeah that was it for episode four we'll do episode five at a later time not really sure when I will try to at least keep up with what I can do until then, I hope you guys enjoy this, and I'll see you guys next.